Welcome back to Field of Fork. And today I have my entrepreneur on the show, Nadine Wardinga, and she's from Cleveland, Georgia. And tell us what you, how you became this entrepreneur with the best chicken salad and pimento cheese. Well, about 25 years ago, I invited the grocery owner, uh, Dean Justice, to my home for lunch. He owned and operated the local IGA in Cleveland. And he had my chicken salad and thought it would be a hit in his grocery store. And so he put in a stove. He did everything to make it possible for us to make chicken salad in his store. And we've been doing that for 25 years. Dean is no longer there, but we're happy to promote Adams Food now because Greg Adams owns the store. And they are our flagship store, which we've gone on to many, many more stores after that. So we're excited to be here and to show you what we do. Well, I um, remember, I remember that first Flavor of Georgia. I met you and you were feeding the troops. I mean, everybody just fell in love with your chicken salad. Well, and I think you gave them a choice even. They did. We always give them a choice between chicken salad and pimento cheese. Um, as I was tasting chicken salad in all of our grocery stores, people kept coming up to me and saying, do you make pimento cheese? Well, after about the hundredth person asked me that, I thought I better create a recipe. So that's what we've come up with is our own version of a pimento cheese. And it's been a huge hit. We sell about 25,000 pounds a year of Wow, it. wow. So how many flavors? Do you just have two we flavors? We just have two products in the grocery store we have the pimento cheese and the chicken salad and you can see from the label here we serve uh, we sell this in a number of stores J Moore Farms both in Commerce and Alto we go all the way up to Pickens County to the Marble Hill IGA mm -hmm. we go as far south as Striblings we also are at the Mountain uh, Fresh Creamery we are in a couple of restaurants where uh, our favorite restaurant up there in Helen is the um, the tavern, and uh, they With have Paul, right? Uh, Paul. Is that Paul? Yeah. Yeah. He has a pizza with pimento cheese. So well, he's got my pickled okra. He uses artisan. See? Uh, yes, we all support each other. Us Southern girls, we got to stick together. That's right. So. Um, that's our beginning. We also have our own apple orchard. I don't know if you know I didn't that or know that. not. Um, we have Glenn's apple butter and we have an organic farm and it is very small. We only have about 120 trees all together, but we feel like we've got the best apple butter of anybody because we do not put pesticides on our apples. They and that's very important because of Roundup and all the yes. things that they claim that are that's causing cancer. So it's all very yeah. natural. Mm -hmm. And then the other product that we sell is my salad dressing. This is a sweet balsamic vinaigrette. And nice. that's what we're gonna do with you today is mm. the salad, we call it killer salad. And you'll understand why all after right. you taste it. Well, let's get started. So. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to chop some onions up and we're just going to set those aside. And if you would do me a favor sure. and put the stick of butter in the pan and get that to melting behind me. Okay. Um, we're going to bring this um, to a nice, crispy, crunchy, unique thing. Everybody knows what this is, but I've taken the time to go ahead and just take a spoon and beat them on the counter and break them up into little tiny crumbs. Um, you're going to remove the flavor packets, that little packet that's in here, and we're going to use two of these. Nice. We have a stick of butter melting in the pan, and I'm going to add to that the ramen noodles. Gonna give it a, a real. It's just gonna crunch, crunch up a up. little bit. Mm -hmm. And when that butter gets good and melted, we'll go ahead and add uh, about a 
fourth or a third of a cup, I like a lot of sesame seeds, um, and about a half a cup of slivered almonds. Okay. We're getting there here. Okay. So Nadine, can they order this online? Or they can, or they can call us and we can ship it to them. Um, I'm so your office, you're, where you, you, you're out of Cleveland. I'm it, out of it Cleveland, would come out of Georgia. Cleveland, Georgia. Yes, and I do have a website. It's called Nadine's Classic Cuisine. So they can order your products, even the apple butter, the balsamic. They can. It's kind of hard to ship chicken salad and pimento cheese. We have shipped it as far away as mm -hmm. Alaska. Yeah. We have a lot of military men that kind of miss getting their chicken salad. Oh, so. wow. But That's it's, nice. It's hard to ship it during the summertime. Okay, this is uh, almost melted okay. in there. So. so let's add in these. And I'm going to put, there we go. The sesame seeds and the almonds. And that's going to get real buttery and crisp. And today I'm using the, the triple washed spring mix. This makes it very easy. You don't have to worry about washing your greens. And you know, springtime, it's a great way to eat lighter and fresh. And you know, I, I even buy this for tailgating. I know oh, when tailgating. I'm for time, I mean, I, this is the perfect thing for tailgating or, or having a small little gathering with my friends. I think we've got this. Okay, all you're gonna do is just spoon mm. that on top. There we go. Is that enough? Yes, that looks That's good. That's great. And All then right. we can toss it with some tongs. All right. And as this goes on here. It smells delicious. The onions and the greens just kind of come together with the hot butter of that. That's nice. Very nice. And then we drizzle it with the sweet balsamic vinaigrette. Now this is very thick and it may take it a little bit, but it's worth the wait. Nice. And you're just... Gives it all that real rich flavor, I'm sure. It really mm -hmm. does. And that is, this is our most requested uh, dish that we serve. We do cater a lot. And this is everybody, if they want a salad, this is what they want. So you don't have to have a lot of items to be in the catering business. If you've got two great items along with some, with the uh, balsamic vinaigrette and apple That's butter, it. is that, you know, I read where you do some pies and I do a lot baking. of pies. My husband makes the best cinnamon mm. rolls you've ever had in yeah. your life. Uh, we come together and, and we kind of come together in the kitchen and he That's helps great. me so much. And our son, John, is going to be rolling out a food truck. Wow. Probably in the next month or Habersham, so. Habersham, did you hear that? <laughs> so <laughs> we're excited wait. about that. I can't wait. And that's a much needed uh, thing for Habersham and the surrounding areas because I know there's so many events that need. Uh, Hand me that little box. Yeah, here we go. We do a lot of these every year, and this little box contains a whole party. Here's your food truck in a box. Here's, yeah. here's your <laughs> conference in a box. You have um, two salads, a nice fruit salad. You have this killer salad along with the dressing. Nice. A bottle of water, two cookies, and a chicken salad croissant. It's all you would need for any event that you're hosting. And we do these for churches. We do them for business meetings, all kinds of different occasions. So, But the food truck would be more for uh, items like wings and, and, you know, it wouldn't be more. It would. So uh, I know crab barbecue cakes. Barbecue maybe. Yes. Things like that. My husband makes great crab cakes as well. Mm -hmm. So there'll be an, a whole slew of different things that my son wants to try. He's a fabulous cook. 
He has worked with some of the finest chefs up in West Virginia. So we're excited. You've done such a, a fabulous job with your products and uh, you. very well known for, for everything. I didn't know about these two, but I'm, I can't wait to try them. I can't wait and, for you to try them. Uh, I appreciate you coming on the show as my entrepreneur. I'm so glad you had and me. I know uh, we will be in touch with your son and, and thank yes. you so much. And tell the audience one more time how they can find you. I have a website, it's Nadine's Classic Cuisine, and you can contact me through that. If you want lunch boxes or products, just let us know. We'd look forward to hearing from you. Yeah, well, thank you guys for joining us today on Field of Fork. We hope you have a very happy spring. Eat well, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>